run a strong heart team, you'll increase both your tavern volume and your surgical volume. So surgeons should not despair. Surgeons will always be needed. Dr. Mike Reardon, like the legend in, in cardiac surgery in the transcatheter valve space, it's incredible to see what you've done in your career. In 2025, what is one thing that you want everyone to know from the perspective of a heart surgeon about valvular heart disease? Well, from the perspective of heart surgeons, heart surgery for valve disease is not going to go away. TAVR has been a true revolution in our treatment. It's probably one of the best things that have happened to patients in the 42 years that I've been doing heart surgery. And we know TAVR goes up every year. But if you look at the, the SDS and TVT data, starting in 2020, open surgery for aortic valve surgery has started back up again. And in fact, I looked at my data and data in my institution for isolated open aortic valve replacement surgically has gone up 20% since 2020. And the reason is that we've formed good valve clinics, good heart teams, and everybody now is willing to come in and look for TAVR, but not everybody's a candidate for TAVR. So if you run a strong heart team, you'll increase both your TAVR volume and your surgical volume. So surgeons should not despair. Surgeons will always be needed, but they need to be part of a good team and collaborative with their cardiology partners. I love that emphasis on a team approach. And so we can be friends, interventional cardiology and cardiac surgery. I do think we can be friends and work very synergistically you're, together. You're my best friend. We're best friends. Yeah. This is my favorite interview of all time. What lights you up in the morning? What makes you get up? And I, I know you have like a very intensive morning routine where you exercise, you prepare for the day. What makes you show up every day to do this job? Well, I get up at 4 a.m. and go to the gym every morning. That's my only free time. And I always thought if you do something hard to begin your day, the rest of the day is easy. But what my job is right now is program building and career building. Medicine has been very good to me. I've had a wonderful career. I've been fortunate. I've had a wonderful wife and family. And what I like to do now is, is start to build programs and, and help my faculty move forward in their career. I get more pleasure out of watching my residents and faculty succeed than myself. And I've reached this point where another paper is not going to matter because my next academic title is going to contain the words emeritus or memory of, and I'm not going to look forward to either one of those. You've done so much for so many people, including myself, including so many people that we know. And so it's amazing to be part of that legacy. Thank you. Well, Priya, thank you so much.